we are back. I don't know why I say we, it's just me. Um, I am back. It is the Saturday wrap. The Saturday wrap for Saturday the 22nd of July 2023. Obviously recorded on the Friday. Friday the 21st, I believe. Anyway, um, if you haven't seen this before, that was the week that was TW3. Yeah, that's been done before, though. Anyway, um, so weather, planting, um, politics, health, um, tech, uh, so, Satoshi's as well. So let us start with that word or phrase of the week. OK, so this is something I haven't heard anything about at all. In fact, it's gone very, very quiet. And where is COVID? Okay, COVID, as we all know, airborne spread, June, really hot. It doesn't like ultraviolet, but no one's mentioning it at all. It's like it's disappeared. People say uh, during the pandemic or during COVID, um, and it's gone, it's disappeared. Okay, winter, it may well come back, but I think possibly, and I could be wrong here, it has just mutated out of itself and is like a common cold. I know people who have had cold, people who have had sore throats, mind you, used to get those anyway, but I think that's where it's gone. Um, yeah, and we won't need any more uh, inoculations or what have you. I don't even know what the current um, uh, variant is. Because we used to hear about new variants and they were deadly and they were much more communicative. But now it's gone. And uh, the world is not the same. The world has changed, obviously. Um, working from home, hybrid working, uh, transportation, all those sorts of things. But where is COVID? Anyway, let's just think about that one. Uh, app of the week. Do you have a blog? Uh, I think it's <coughs> cough. I hope that's not. Um, thirty-four percent of the blogs, or thirty-four percent of the World Wide Web, is a WordPress blog, and you can use the Jetpack app on iOS or iPad OS or Android OS. Um, it's really good. Um, it's it's a text box editor thing where you create a box you put something in it and you just stick it under or above the previous line um i really like it i have a wordpress blog i think i've had it since 2010 um when it migrated from microsoft spaces possibly can't even remember to be honest um it's nice and you can just set up something just save it as a draft and it'll just stay there nicely and you can add to it as you see fit obviously if you want to put video on your blog that becomes more expensive but hey that's what youtube is for create the video post it from youtube free by the way and you can get a free wordpress blog at uh, wordpress.org was it wordpress.com wordpress.com wordpress.org is where you download it for sticking on your own blog there you go um recommend it get your own blog yeah definitely get your own blog a thing of the week okay so this brings together a lot of different things uh those of you who've watched this before know that i have started this year going into satoshis which is one hundredth millionth of a Bitcoin. And you can get them for free. You can just go to uh, various websites um, like coin to play um, and answer a couple of questions, some surveys, you get Satoshis. Uh, you go to Bitcoin app, uh, read some of their web postings, get some Satoshis. Yeah, and um, also Fountain app, the um, media player the podcast player which i thought well they've got it in for me and they've stopped me getting free for satoshis i had an email this morning saying we fixed it and now i'm getting satoshis again so 
I'm getting all these free Satoshis. And basically for listening to podcasts, I want to give some of that back. Adam Curry, the Podfathers, V for V. Now I thought, hmm, how about the Daily Tech News Show? And it took me ages to do, and it finally went off in April when I was in Porter's Head. Tom read it out today. And he likes the idea. Uh, and he did have, I didn't know this, he did have a wallet ID on his site before. But, and he has also mentioned value for value a couple of times, dropped it into some of his podcasts. If you don't know about the Daily Tech News Show, DTNS. Go and listen. A very even-handed, no political slant, really good news, nothing boring, couple of deep dives. Um, I go for the Patreon, the longer version, which is just them shooting the breeze, talking about tech, talking about food, doing quizzes. It's really good. Anyway, bottom line, TLDR. Yeah, I'm going to do it, um, but I just haven't got around to it yet, and I want to do it well. Meanwhile, I am collecting Satoshis. <laughs> and uh, Bitcoin is down slightly to $29,000 to the Bitcoin. So, um, yeah, value for value. Valueforvalue.org. Mm, okay, so it was the editor's desk of the Daily Tech News Show, uh, which you can only get if you're on Patreon. Um, but I recommend that you go there. And you can get Molly Wood on there once a month as well if you're lucky. So, last Friday night, moving on. After this, after posting it and all that sort of thing, Series 2 of The Foundation. It started off really well. I'm still not sure about the arc because it doesn't really follow the book that well, but wow, the production values are absolutely excellent. You can see where the money goes. The acting is very good and it's a lot faster and I think this series will be really good. However, series three on hold due to actor strike. Yeah, whatever. There you go. Um, Saturday, well, I went to Newport and I came home on the three o'clock bus, which is very unlike me. Uh, I think I'm getting old. I just can't drink as much as I used to be able to, which is just as well because, well, it's been a rather expensive month. Definitely a rather expensive month. But what can you do? Anyway, um, uh, Sunday. What did it say? Oh, yeah. Red, red summer onions from the garden. Lovely, mild, colourful, went with a salad, cut them up, sliced them. It is really nice in the summer to come home. Onions from the garden, lettuce leaves from the garden, mint from the garden or the windowsill, lemon basil from the windowsill, put it all together, stick some coleslaw on top of it, a couple of slices of cucumber, soon from the garden. Also tomatoes, soon from the garden. Vinegar, not from the garden, from Aldi, but there you go. And some scraps of meat because, yeah, uh, I'm an omnivore. But that was good. Oh, yeah, because um, Sunday afternoon, a bit of For All Mankind. And um, I thought I'd try out Silo because it's got really good reviews. This is all Apple TV Plus, by the way. Silo, wow, what an excellent program. What an absolute corker. Love it. Um, bingeable because it's gone through its series I think there's a second series coming well worth looking out for to be perfectly honest um, Monday and it was dark going into work uh, and the mornings are drawing in the nights slowly but they're going quickly and we'll soon be in August and at the end of August it'll be getting dark about eight o'clock the year the year is just slipping away, to be perfectly honest. Um, schools are breaking up. People are travelling. Uh, apparently there's chaos on the roads at the moment because there's 13 million vehicles travelling about. Uh, I'm glad. I'm glad I'm not one of them. Really glad I'm not one of them. Um, oh, yeah. 
And another sign of the time of the year. I tried to book my car in for minor service and MOT on a Saturday morning. It was greyed out. I had to phone it in. Uh, not cheap, um, but it is a minor service. Whew. Just as well. And I hope they don't find anything else because, you know, times are very hard, etc. But having to phone it in? And I'll really show up. Uh, Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday, uh, I didn't wear my contact lenses to work. I wore glasses. Basically because I got toothpaste residue in my eye. Stung a bit. And I didn't want to put lenses on top of it. And then they get sucked into the lens and stick. Oh, oof. Yeah, it's one of the things you do when you get older. You make silly mistakes. Actually, I made silly mistakes all through my life. But what can you do? Again. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. Thursday, dipped headlights to work. Definitely getting darker. Also, Thursday, planted out one pepper plant. It's out in the garden now, being well watered. Tomorrow is looking like a washout, so I hope it's okay. Mind you, the lawn could do with more rain. We've had a little bit of rain this week, so there you go. Uh, this morning, the editor's desk, as I've already mentioned. I do like Tom Merritt. He is scrupulously fair. And also, the email from Fountain App. 90 sats for just listening to a promo. It's good. I'm going to have to start doing a bit of value for my value and sending some of those sats back. Anyway, that was my week. You know, things. Um, and um, there will be more foundation after this. So, thank you very much. Comments as per normal. It'll be on all the socials. Although, Twitter. Um, no longer cross posts from Untapped. No longer cross posts from LinkedIn. It's dying. It's going away. It's not long for this world. Anyway, bye bye.